Terminal High Altitude Area Defense is an American anti-ballistic missile defense system designed to shoot down short, medium, and intermediate range ballistic missiles in their terminal phase, descent or re-entry, by intercepting with a hit-to-kill approach. TAN was developed after the experience of Iraq's Scud missile attacks during the Gulf War in 1991. The TAN interceptor carries no warhead, instead relying on its kinetic energy of impact to destroy the incoming missile. TAN has come under the umbrella of the Missile Defense Agency, the Navy has a similar program, the sea-based Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense System, which also has a land component, Aegis Ashore. The TOD missile has the ability to intercept enemy missiles, which come at an altitude of about 40 to 50 kilometers. On that basis, the TOD missile is unsuitable for pursuing enemy fighter jets, which fly at much lower altitudes. This land-based missile defense system can be used quickly, with high mobility, with a range of 200 km and an altitude of up to 150 km. TOD is a system interoperable with other ballistic missile defense system, BMDS, elements and can receive signals from Aegis, satellites and other external sensors, and work in tandem with the Patriot Pac-3 system. The TOD system also has a layer defensive shield or shield, layer defense commonly used to protect strategic sites or high-value tactics such as airfields or population centers. The TOD system itself consists of four components, namely the launcher, missiles, fire control, and radar. The first component of TOD is launcher mounted on the M1075 truck. This launcher is easy to move and can load up to eight missiles. After shooting, it may take 30 minutes for the launcher to reload. The next component is the missile. The missile contained in TOD itself measures 6.17 meters long and weighs 900 kilograms. 